happening people this is Roy here and in this video I'm going to discuss one of the themes that has been prevalent in a lot of my videos taken in 2023 and these videos has not yet been made public yet so I want to discuss and say why I was wrong first and I definitely want to apologize as well and it has happened because of arrogance hate loneliness and I was having a different mindset back then and all of that was prevalent in those vlogs I mean when 2023 started it was a new year for me 2020 you got done and I had an amazing 2022 with the kind of social life 2023 is zero social life outside of campus but also my mindset changed in a lot of ways when the year started I told myself you know what I'm just going to have fun go on solo dates and all of that on campus yes you are running into a lot of people but outside campus I was not meeting anyone so it was more about that mindset I'm like yes I have to go and explore at the same time I felt like I had to justify for myself and be like oh this is why I'm doing this I have to speak for myself I have to defend for myself so whenever i was doing all these vlogs in the end in the outer i'd be like there's no other indian international student who's doing this in a lot of ways that's true too because the kind of activities that i do in one day and the kind of things that i've done throughout one year i did not have like youtube was witness i'm putting out all those videos and people who are watching get to know what i am up to or what all i'm doing in life but at the same time i did not have anyone around me to talk to and say oh look at what all i did and for me i'm like i'm done with the talking stage as well and being like oh look at i did this i did that for me that's not giving the thrill anymore so for me in those vlogs in those outros i would be like oh i'm the look who else as an internet international student is doing this doing that look at what i'm doing look at what all i achieved till now so that was the kind of tone that i used definitely it's because of arrogance uh slight loneliness was also there but also you'll see that there's a lot of shift after july because in july i recorded one more vlog which has not yet been made public and in that i i literally called it a hate journal and i discussed what's the point of having so much hate in yourself like what are you going to use it all all that for and whenever you do crazy stuff like people do notice i've been going to ball drop that's not something which people would just like that go but people do notice when you do things so i don't have to like justify just for myself that's one thing which i realized i'm not going to say like oh there's no other indian international student doing this yes in a lot of ways it's standard because of the kind of solo dates that have been on in new york city or the kind of life that i had till now as an indian international student the kind of course that i'm doing the kind of uh, life that i've been on the kind of the way how I fought for every single thing, whether it's for job, kind of finding a home or all those topics, I feel that sets me apart. But at the same time, it's not an excuse to use and say that's why what makes me special or better than people makes me special, makes me unique in a lot of ways. Definitely, yes. But it does not make me better than anyone or does not put me down. Then, you know, that's one thing which I realized. Definitely, I have to apologize for that. Same time, I feel I've become a lot more grateful and my mindset has changed a lot of ways i don't say oh i'm better than this I'm be i i always say like there's levels in a lot of games and i realize that i'm on a different level altogether based on what i've done till now and the kind of mindset like yeah in vlogs you can say whatever you want but when people meet in person that's when they actually realize my mindset or how i actually am like when you meet in person yeah you know you cannot hide so much and all that stuff right so i realize that i'm a lot more calm a lot more composed the kind of uh, collected nature and a lot of things definitely i mean um therapy sessions itself i cross more than one or two sessions per week so it's definitely a lot of sessions and then the kind of self-awareness that has increased and the kind of mindset changed like earlier i used to do things to distract when i was lonely now i don't get lonely at all that's a different thing getting so much you cannot you cannot be an ordinary person to go to new york city alone for so many times and be like this is my city i can do whatever i want and cover the kind of places that i've covered beaches bars everything alone and going 10 plus museums, covering museums twice, going there to vlog and getting lost in museum, getting lost in whatever I do and covering nine food places, famous food places after doing research in two days. And yeah, I mean, you know the finance as an international student, but I feel here also somewhere inside I'm justifying why and so, but I realize that in the, the kind of theme that I'm having from 2024 or actually from the yeah, videos taken from July of 2023 till now, now it's February of 2024, I realize there's a lot of change. But there have been so many videos that has been taken from January till July of 2023. And that those are kind of videos that I'm addressing till now. I do have a very small audience, so it does not matter. Like people are watching who, who watch or have been part of the journey, they will understand. Um, but apart from that, I'm just grateful that I get to go to and do all this. trip, get to do all these things on campus, on Ruggers campus and all this stuff. I'm just very grateful, very grateful for the kind of journey that I've had, hoping for more opportunities. But yeah, all those vlogs will also come out. So that's when you'll realize what I'm actually discussing and talking about. But at the end of the day, uh, Rohit is a one-man army and Rohensure is a one-man show. It's all about venturing and doing stuff, which I feel 
it's another level altogether. I'm just happy and grateful. Say I'll catch you in another one. Till then, bye from me.